Hi, I'm Mark Ryman, Learning Center Agronomist here at Gothenburg, Nebraska for Bayer. And today we're out kind of looking at the cornfields and our main concern here is really the water situation. And so right now this is corn we planted um, April 24th. It's at about the V10 growth stage if you count the leaf, leaf collars all the way to the bottom. And you know, it's in that stage right now, it's vegetative. Because of the weather conditions the past few days, we have seen a little drought stress in it, but it's not really at a stage where you're affecting yield a lot. That happens much more in the kind of early pollination, early grain fill growth stages for the corn. So one of the big decisions we're trying to make is, you know, when do we start irrigating? If water is not limiting to you, you know, watering right now may protect a little bit of yield, but you know, we're at the stage where the roots under the corn are at about two feet deep. And because the corn right now is going for moisture that we've picked up in the kind of second and third foots, I think we're, we're growing those roots a little bit deeper. That's a critical thing we may need later in the season. If water is a limiting factor, say you've got an allocation or something like that that you're dealing with, you really want to, at this growth stage, probably let it go if you can with a little bit of stress because we're not affecting yield much and save it you know for that critical period of kind of early pollination and early grain fill the corn's going to need about eight inches of water in about that 25 days around when it starts tasseling to the blister growth stage so that's really something we want to be preserving that water for that's when a lot of your yield is made and then you can kind of let it dry out to the end of the season Kind of what we're looking at out here is we've got good moisture, um, especially in the third foot that the corn's rooting down to. We've got some moisture in the second foot and that top foot is pretty dry where the corn's utilized it. So the goal is to get the corn to root down some, to go after that deeper moisture and preserve the water that we can uh, for, for later in the season when we're doing a kind of more critical piece of setting yield. And we are hoping to get a little bit of rain over the next maybe four to five days and the temperatures are going to be certainly cooler than they have been this past week so i think we're going to make it through this time frame without irrigating uh, we'll see what next week brings we'll kind of continue to update you on this throughout the growing season we look forward to giving you more agronomic advice from the learning center thanks for watching this video from the gothenburg water utilization learning center for more information please call 308-537 four five zero zero